just five days until the Red Wings drop the puck on the new season. And if the first two days of Wings camp is any indication, not all hockey fans are ready to turn their backs on the game. Over 2,000 fans showed up to watch practice on Sunday. Today, CompuWare Sports Arena was about a third full. One of the people on hand was our resident hockey guru, Larry Figurski. He caught up with Mike Knubel afterwards. Well, there are 13 players with Grand Rapids ties here in Camp Jack, 12 of them former Griffins, including recently recalled defenseman Brendan Smith and Brian Lashoff, the other West Michigan native and resident once again, Mike Knubel, the 16-year NHL veteran who scored 20 goals in eight consecutive seasons before last year, was invited to camp on a personal tryout by the Red Wings. And while he knows the odds are stacked against him, he does offer size and experience few others can. You know, I'm a Michigan kid. You know, I grew up here, I started here, but... Um, you know, I'm thankful for the opportunity. I think that's a big thing. You know, you get a chance to come out again and play. And I know the deal. I, I get, the, I get the deal. And it's the teams are hitting the ground running. And um, you know, they they've been thinking about their lineup for eight months. You know, and it's not like things are going to change in a week. You know, that being said, guys drop with injuries. Things happen. It's going to be an incredible year once it gets going. So you just want to try and get yourself in the mix as, as another option. And, and you know, I guess. I like to say you don't want to, you know, you might not be able to play your way onto the team, but you don't want to play your way off it either. Now, there was some concern about injuries with this shortened training camp. Michael Samuelson out today and is now listed as day to day with a groin injury. Pavel Datsuk expected to arrive back in Detroit from Russia also today and should be in the lineup for tomorrow night's red and white game. In Plymouth, Larry Figurski, 24 hour news 8.